I found this course at ECU, which is Counterterrorism, Security and Intelligence. And I found a couple of other courses as well in different countries, but none of them had the same broad um, options as ECU does, where you get to do both intelligence, terrorism, and security science, uh, which is why I ultimately picked ECU in the end. So part of uh, the course is to engage with industry and um, we've been offered the options of going to, to certain visits with industry as well. So we've been um, to a maximum security prison and visited um, their facilities to see how everything runs and, and what they do. And we've been to uh, Perth Convention Centre and looked at their access control and CCTV system, so what type of cameras they have and how their recording works and what they focus on, which is really good. Um, it gives you that um, job-related um, knowledge, not just theory, um, so we get to do that. And in the future, I would like to really go into intelligence analysis. In the course that I've done at ECU in terms of uh, counterterrorism, security and intelligence, as well as my honours and my PhD, has really helped me develop the analytical abilities and the, the critical thinking skills that I need in order to become an intelligence analyst. Completing a PhD in the area of uh, developing a knowledge framework for aviation security and it sort of looks at extracting both from literature and as well industry engagement what the knowledge topic areas are within aviation security if you're working at a higher level. So not screening level, but security management level at airports. As part of my PhD, my supervisors that I have uh, both have uh, industry experience, so they're both ex-militaries and special forces, which is, is really, really great for me. 